Yo, what's up guys, Butter Your Butters here. I am just going to bring to you a quick video of my evil Linden campaign. I'm currently fighting an army of Dunland. Uh, quick backstory behind that. I bought Matrice off of them for the sum of uh, 10,000 plus 40,000 paid over the next five turns. And they declared war on me the next turn. Trying to take back Matrice. They made a big mistake, and now they desperately want peace that I'm not giving to them. Uh, I have reduced Breland in the Shire to Archit and Bree. And the Dunedains still love me, as do the Dwarves of Erluin. So, right now my main enemy is Dunland, and, uh... Yeah, I Send them back to their underworld. This should be a relatively easy battle, considering they only have one full unit of horsemen, and those are Dunland horsemen. And their second unit of... Horses only has 18, and they only have 13 of the down here champions left, so should be an easy battle. But basically, third age total of war, I'm just going to say this now. On my channel, it's going to come back for version 1. When version 1 of the game is released, I forgot I had a ballista in this army, that's going to make things annoying. That ballista is going to get destroyed. Uh, I'm going to bring back uh, third age total war to my channel regularly when version 1 of the game is released, which is not too far off now. Damn you, phone. Uh, the reason for that is it version 1 is a rather substantial change to the game. And it will change the way a lot of my campaigns are fought, so... You know, I wish when you put the general in a group, it would put him in the middle. Because your general should not be the first person in and out of battle. There we go. That's a much better formation that I can get behind. See what my the my strategy for this battle is. My large amount of bowmen should make them come straight to me. And with any luck, they'll try to go straight for my ballista, which will allow me to easily flank and make things happy. And I'm going to save my only unit of Teleri Riders until I've destroyed their horsemen, and I can just, you know, demolish their ranged units. But yeah, basically, um, Dale and Khan are going to come back for version 1. What I'm going to do is I'm going to record myself getting back to the same, like, turn and, you know, general situation I was at before, uh, but I'm gonna upload them in, like, either one-hour videos, two-hour, like, chunks, and I'll just, like, put timestamps of battles in the description for you to jump to, just so you can see what happened, and then it'll be right back to normal with those. And I might do a Dwarves campaign, just because version 1 has released Kazid Doom. Now, I'm not sure when version 1's gonna re be, re be released, but it should be soon. Uh, the archers, I all want. Fire at will, yes. Guard mode. And everyone else can pursue. Uh, and I want them on normal shot. And then I'm going to immediately pause the game, and we're going to start our first Third Age Star War battle in a long time. Alright, so this is how they're set up. Got the light horsemen. Yeah, it's a very depleted army. I'm surprised they're actually attacking me. But it looks like they are they deployed on my flank, which is not a good time, so I just want to make it so that they cannot flank my uh I wanna make it so they can't flank my archers. There we go. Uh I want you firing at will. And I forgot how to unpause, it's been so long. There we are. So this guy's already firing. What's he firing at? It doesn't really matter what he fires at. Yeah, they're gonna come straight to me. Those Beast Slayers are gonna be annoying, but I want the Dunhir Champions to die. I thought there was only 12 of those instead of 126. Okay. If they're, they're gonna do something that foolish, I'm going to set this guy... Alright, my archers are starting to fire, that's good. 
Unless their melee lines run into my archers, they cannot charge my archers with cavalry, and that's the main thing. Uh, I want all my guys on their beast slayers, because they're the best uh, unit of archers that they have. Alright. I'll get these guys over here. I'm pretty sure these ballistas are going to wind up firing into my own men, so... I'm gonna push these guys back over this way. Now I don't want the um, the beast hunters hitting my cavalry because they get a bonus to cavalry. We're right about to hit these guys right in the side. That was a horrendous charge. Let's get these guys out of there. They just ran away from me. That's annoying. I hate when that happens. Oh yeah, the champions are firing. That's not good. Fire at these guys. Yeah, my uh, cavalry didn't exactly enjoy that. So they just charged straight into my defensive line. That's intelligent. No, actually, you guys stay. If we continue now, like this, we will smash the enemy. Who are we charge into the chieftain's bodyguard? That's not too bad. Okay, there. Those archers, not those archers. What are these, the outlaws fighting my archers? That should be fine. Try to get a good charge into those beast slayers. This fight should be easy enough. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Yeah. Figured the uh, cavalry would do that. Just reform. The archers can't really do anything to me. Not the archers. They're cavalry. Right, let's see if I can't cut off their head. I'm gonna charge with one unit of archers. Oh, that's a good charge right into the back of their general. That side's still fine. We're losing more in this battle than I would like. Let's get back to the Beast Slayer, shall we? No, I actually go after those cavalry so they can't charge me again. There we go. That's those. Get rid of those. Yeah, their, their general should fall any second now. There's only seven Beast Slayers left, so their archers are literally no more threat. It's just their general hasn't died yet, otherwise this battle would be over. Alright, let's just overwhelm their general. Yeah, their infantry here are getting wrecked. My infantry has held up pretty well, except for these guys. These guys have actually gotten really hurt. Alright, 
so I don't need all these guys here. These guys over here. That's it, just keep hunting down their archers. And get into those champions. Yep, those guys are routing. It's only a matter of time now. Their general is the only one left in that army. I guess I should tell you to stop. There we are. And this battle's over, pretty much. There we go! I have done good thing today. The enemy army flees the field. Yeah, we lost too many men in that. 301. I could have done that a little better. Casualty Sassine, mainly my Teleri archers and my Teleri swordsmen. That's not good. Although some of my archers did get healed. None of my... Oh, nine of my riders got healed. None of them got were lost, unfortunately. And they only killed 150. My Fallout Swords really didn't do much. It was mostly archers. My Ballista got 12 kills! Yay! Yay. My, 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 that battle did not go as great as I hoped it would. That one charge against their cavalry where they just ran away and then turned to fight me, that did a lot of damage to my cavalry. We protect the Elven lands. They don't like me anymore. Follow me. Let's see. Now I'm going to merge everyone here. By the light of I don't Elmer. think I can reach any trees. Would I be able to ambush anyone Over from here? here? Elves. It doesn't matter. Follow me. Because this army could come and attack. Come and get me, you coward. It looks like a lot of crap. Although they do have some berserkers. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Yep. And uh, Third Age to War is coming back when version 1 comes back. So yeah, I'll see you guys then. How do I end the recording? It's been too long.